You couldn't find anyone either? Weird. Now I'm starting to worry. Everyone's disappeared. This is pretty weird. What are we... What are you doing here, by the way, Cadence? The lighthouse isn't working. What? Something must have happened while I was away. I ne I've never seen the lighthouse go dark, and my whole family have just vanished? Something must have happened. Quick, we're going to have to get to the lighthouse fast. Maybe they're there. Follow me, Cadence. Ooh, oh, she's off on a run. Where are we going? Oh, to the lighthouse. Got it. Oh, okay. Let us run! Picture spot. I decided to stick to the winding road just to see. Just to see. Whoa, there it is! That's a pretty cool looking lighthouse. Who wants to build that in Minecraft? <gasps> oh. To the darkened lighthouse, conditions fulfilled. Oh, I'm standing on people, I'm sorry. <laughs> the door's locked and nobody's answering when I knock. Where can they be? We gotta find the key to the lighthouse door, Cadence. Mm. Sigrid, the lighthouse keeper, has a spare key hidden around here somewhere. I, I just can't be sure where it is. Where on earth is it? You think we should split up so that we can look faster? Great idea. Quick, we need to find it. Alright, so we're looking for a key. A key? In the flowers? Nope. A key on the stairs? Nope. Oh, how about over here? A key in the barrels? Uh, nope. I don't think so. Or maybe we did find them. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, we did! We found it! We found the key! Found the key! Yay! Oh, I think I clicked twice. Quick, Cadence, unlock the door. If they're not in there, Perhaps you'll see something at the top of the lighthouse. Okay. That is a really cool lighthouse. <laughs> oh, use the key. I'm sorry, I forgot. You look for Holly's family from the top of the lighthouse. Oh, look, there's people. Cape Sorrow. Oh, what is going on here? That must be them. It must be. They're alive! Thank goodness! Did you see them, Cadence? Yeah, me too. That's the whole family. Sigrid, Jonas, Eric, and Madison. But how did they all manage to get stranded at Cape Sorrow? I don't know how they've managed to get themselves stuck at Cape Sorrow, Cadence, but we need to rescue them. They must have been there at least a day, and I couldn't see any food, camping gear, or anything. They must be freezing and hungry, and poor little Madison, I hope she's okay. You've got a horse, Cadence. Can I sit behind you while you ride? Great. Ride down to the beach below the lighthouse, Cadence. It's opposite Cape Sorrow. You'll need to take the path going past the ferry landing, since there's no way to get down the cliffs here. Come on, Cadence. Let's save my family. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. All right. Ooh, she looks like she's intently staring at the back of my head. There's a path, she says? Where are we? Oh, we're over here. Oh, so there's the ferry landing. We have to go this way. Wow, there's some huge, like, pretty rocks over here. All right, I think we're closing in on the correct area. Finally. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. Here we are. Here we are. Hello, can you hear me over there? 
The wind is too strong, Cadence. They can't hear me when I yell. I think they've seen us, though, and they seem to be all right, don't they? Madison looks like she's in good shape. Wait, can you see Jonas? He looks rather weak. I hope he's not injured. How are we going to get to Cape Sorrow, Cadence? I can't see Jonas's fishing boat or our little motorboat anywhere. I'd, I'd try to get there on my surfboard, but that just gets swept out to sea or smash up against the cliffs. Could be worth a try anyway, right? What do you think, Cadence? I suppose we don't have any other choice. You've got a boat, you say? Of course you have. How old would you have got here? Hurry and bring it here. I'll wait here and try to come up with a plan in the meantime. Alright, I guess we're going back to get our boat. You're back at the boat, still in great condition. You cast off and set sail towards Holly. Dead man sands, oh gosh. <laughs> Alright, we brought the boat, Holly. Nice boat, Cadence, but are you sure it's seaworthy? It looks to be in pretty lousy shape. Hey man, we fixed up that boat ourselves, and we thought we did a pretty good job. Cadence, I think it's best if you take the boat to Cape Sorrow yourself. The more space you have in the boat, the fewer trips you'll need to make to pick everyone up. Just take it easy, okay? The waters around Cape Sorrow are full of really strong currents and dangerous ground. Plenty of ships and boats have met their end on the Cape, and I really don't want you to join them. Good luck. Oh, thanks. It's real dangerous. You go save my family. I'll wait here. <laughs> Cape Sorrow. What was her family doing out there? I guess we're about to find out. Sigrid. Hello there, I'm Sigrid, South Hoof's lighthouse keeper. Might I ask who you are? Cadence? Delightful. You are here to save us, you say? I saw you on your way here, and you're a decent navigator. But is your boat really seaworthy? You're stranded! Are you really concerned if my boat is seaworthy? How we're feeling, you ask? Considering the circumstances, everyone is doing rather well. Except for my husband, Jonas. He says he's fine, but I know he's not just trying to not worry me. He was in the water long after the boat went down, and he gave all his dry clothes... Oh, he gave all the dry clothes he managed to save to Madison so that she wouldn't freeze. Was the pink tutu his? His temperature was right down, and even though he's stronger than a walrus, he might... What happened, you asked? Well, Jonas had taken Madison out on a fishing trip, but when they were on their way home, Jonas steered a little too close to Cape Sorrow. He knows how dangerous the water is here, but he wanted to show Madison one of his favorite cliffs out this way. It was pretty stupid of him, but he meant well, as he always does. The fishing boat ran aground and sank almost immediately, but Jonas managed to swim ashore with Madison. I saw what happened from up in the lighthouse, so I ran down to the farm and got Eric. Together we took our boat and got to Cape Sorrow as quickly as we could, but sadly, Eric also managed to run aground. Jonas had to throw himself into the water again to save us. He got us up onto the shore, but I think it was too much, even for my lovely, brave husband. I don't think there's any danger to my Jonas, but maybe you could take a look at him? Well, I guess we're not we're no doctor, but <laughs> sure Jonas how you feeling bro? We're no doctor, but we're gonna check on you anyway <laughs> Hello uh, I'm almost b -b -b back on my, my, my feet again. No worries Tell, tell Sigrid that she, she she doesn't have to w worry <laughs> He sounds really cold <laughs> How does Jonas seem to you, Cadence? How's he feeling? He says everything's fine. He said that to me as well. Do you believe him? No? Hmm. I don't either. He doesn't want to worry me, so he's just saying he feels okay. You think he's quite seriously sick? Oh no. Well, I mean, he's really cold. Cadence, take Jonas back to Holly right away. The rest of us can cope here for a little while longer. Don't worry. Ask Holly to take Jonas up to the farm. She needs to make sure he's warm and gets plenty of rest. Hurry now. I could take the kid, too. I could. <laughs> I got room in the boat. I guess next time I, I don't have to bring the horse. <laughs> he probably takes up a lot of room. Holly and Jonas. Hey, kittens. Everyone's fine, you say? That's a relief to hear. But, um, how's Jonas? Jonas, are you alright? Sigrid asked me to take him straight back to the farm, you say? Absolutely. We'll get there as fast as we can. Will you be alright to get the others on your own, Cadence? Great. Jonas, can you hear me? 
Put your weight on me, and we'll get back to the farm so you can rest. See you up at the farm soon enough, Cadence. Good luck. Are they going to take my boat? How are they? They're going to walk back? All right. How did it go with Jonas? Holly took him straight up to the farm, you say? Good. Everything should turn out fine then. As long as my Jonas gets to warm up and have a little rest, he should be fine in no time. Can we take a moment to talk about how handsome my wolf would looks with her matching jacket and horse tack? The blue and the purple match her beautiful blue and purple hat. And lovely jacket. I am kind of in love with this jacket, I must say. Pink trendy trench coat that I cannot wear yet. Mm, typical. But I love it. She looks great. I love that it matches the horse gear. I love it. Exclusive blue spring saddle. Hmm. Well, son, okay. Eric, Madison, listen now. This is Cadence and she's here to rescue us. Go over and sit in her boat so that she can take us back to South Hoof. Everything will be fine. The boat is safe and you don't need to worry, okay? Hurry along now. There you go, Cadence. We're ready to head back to South Hoof. Sail carefully, you promise? Of course I promise. Alright, let's get everybody in this boat. And get them back to safety. I, th I think to Dead Man Sands. Probably, probably should have gone to the, the landing. Oh, nope, okay, good. <laughs> Eric, Madison, hurry home now, go at once. You need to get warm and have some food. Hurry along. Cadence, I give you my thanks. If it wasn't for you, I'm not sure we would have made it, if I'm honest. I'm so worried about my husband, Cadence. Imagine if he's seriously ill. I need to hurry back to the farm. I can sit behind you on your horse, you say? I haven't ridden so much, Cadence. Are you sure it'll be okay? Thank you. To the farm. <laughs> to the farm. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye, little girl and her daddy. You don't get to ride. Only the lighthouse keeper in her lovely blue jacket get to. <laughs> don't get sick. Blah. Blah. <laughs> I wonder if there's a place to feed and water my horse. Hey, there's Jonas. Aw, we made it. Home at last. It's never been nicer to get back home as it is now. Thanks for the ride, Cadence. Now I need to check on my Jonas. You're welcome. Alright guys, thanks for hanging out with me today and checking out South Hoof Peninsula. It's been so much fun so far. I cannot wait to check out more of it. It's going to be so much fun. I know everyone is rushing through the quests and stuff and there's some, uh, a couple like stayovers where you would have to stay over the night to get the new quests. Um, so there's quite a bit to do and I'm very much looking forward to it to it but I've had so much fun doing what we did so far um, and thank you to everyone who stopped and said hello it was nice meeting you um, this is nowhere near as crowded as Windstar is holy cow Windstar is crazy this is nowhere near I'm on chocolate cupcake it is nowhere near as crowded as Windstar is Windstar was crazy this morning could not believe it um, but it, it's it's a lot easier when you don't have so much going on to try and get the quest done. So it's a lot of fun, and I hope you guys are enjoying it. Let me know what you think. Take lots of pictures. I've taken dozens and dozens so far. So, all right. I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.